it's the story of belief it's the story of an attitude of never giving up uh, and it's a story of of triumph and obviously at the same time it's also a story of redemption for my character and um it's it's been a thoroughly enjoyable journey for me as an actor um and um i hope that the audience will share our enthusiasm and emotion the story was i mean i think it's very unique it's um it's aspirational it's inspirational um of seeing a girl with just one hand managing to play for the national cricket team that is all fantastic but for me the x factor was what makes it stand apart from uh, and what makes it uniquely balki is the fact that you have this very acerbic tongue um you know this gruntled bitter person as a coach i have always been obsessed with the game i have loved cricket and played it since i was a child i have followed it very closely and our director balki is also just as obsessed about the game ab also loves the game so we all were a very uh, cricket crazy group that got together uh, with regards to my training i am a right hander in my real life so i had to obviously train to do everything with my left hand uh, fortunately i had the time i had like four three four months to do it so we got in a uh, indian ex indian cricketer to come and coach me with regards to doing things with my left hand i for two three months used to do pretty much like like cooking or driving or like waking up brushing my teeth with my left hand so i i was aware with how difficult it's going to be tying your shoelace with the left hand but when he asked me to cut a jungle down i didn't think i was really prepared for that uh, so there was a lot of uh, blood sweat and real tears that went into cutting the jungle down we used to keep my hand tied up behind and and then we had a prosthetic over it so we didn't go down the green sleeve route but i used to keep it tied up behind uh, so physically it was uh, it was exciting it was very challenging and i i thoroughly enjoyed going on a film set and uh, playing a sport that i really enjoyed it's not a big deal which it might be in our society today in india that he has a transgender as a house help and and she's his what we call a rakhi sister you know um he doesn't make a big deal out of it and that's what i really enjoyed about balki's work is he's actually addressed a lot of themes which are very important can be looked upon as risque to to bring up uh, in a film but handled it with such delicacy that he doesn't really try to highlight a point he's not trying to rah rah about the whole thing he just mentions it and it stays with you and i think it stays with you because it's he's handled in such a nonchalant manner he's not trying to make a big deal of it and i really like that as an approach i think that's a far better more constructive way to approach these themes than to actually really go and underline them and try and make a point about them i think by and large um we're all moving in the right direction and we're trying to be far more inclusive than we would have thought of being in the past now it's a conscious decision as well and that's always a good thing at least you're thinking about it you're addressing the issue indian cinema has come a long way there were there were those few films which were made which were female centric films and which were all the bad roles for female uh led films i think that's changed in a big way and we're seeing a lot more films like that in the recent past It's always wonderful to you know be in the same film as as your acting idol and your hero. It's always wonderful. Sadly in this film we didn't really get to share camera time with each other, but it's always a it's an honor and a pleasure. I think there's so much to learn from him even at this age. He's 81 years old. Uh, he's busier than he's ever been. His his zest and enthusiasm for his work is unparalleled. I mean he's like a kid in a candy store when he's on set. Uh, you can still see that you know he's still scared before his first day uh, he's still nervous he wants to rehearse he wants to work hard and he's just the ultimate example for me and it's just i'm so so happy that i get to you know be in the same film as him again